Hey guys, welcome back to Six Sister Stuff. Today I'm making orange chicken in the Instant Pot. My name is Kristen and this is, what's your name? Sarah. I am sister number two from SixSisterStuff.com and every Monday I share with you a new Instant Pot recipe. So today I'm making orange chicken. You like chicken? Chicken. Yeah, we like it. Now chicken is one of my most favorite things to make in the Instant Pot, but this orange chicken is a little bit different. It's kind of sweet, it's a little tangy, and I absolutely love it. Now you can make this recipe with chicken breast or chicken thighs, whatever one works best for you. I personally like chicken thighs, but I didn't have any thighs, so I made it with chicken breast, but the chicken thighs just seem to have a better texture when making this recipe. All right guys, let's head on over to my Instant Pot and I'll show you how to make this delicious orange chicken. So I'm gonna start with four frozen chicken breasts and then I'm gonna add a half a cup of your favorite barbecue sauce. Next, you're gonna add two tablespoons of soy sauce. Then on top of that, I'm gonna add about a half a cup of water. Now it's time to put the lid on and we are ready to go. Just make sure your little knob is turned to sealing, not venting. Now I'm gonna push the manual button or the pressure cook button, they're the same. And because it's frozen, I'm gonna go up to 25 minutes. Now when the timer was done, I turned the little knob to let out all of the pressure. Once the pressure's out, you can go ahead and lift up your lid. Now once your chicken is all the way done cooking, go ahead and take it out of the pot and we're going to chop it up. Now you can either chop it up into pieces or you can shred it, whatever works best for you. Now when you're done cutting up all your chicken, go ahead and let it sit out. We're going to make a little slurry. So we're gonna add a fourth cup of the juice that was in your Instant Pot and two teaspoons of cornstarch. Go ahead and mix that really well so the cornstarch will dissolve in the liquid. Now when that's all mixed together, go ahead and push the saute button, then you're going to add some more liquid. So I'm going to add a half cup of orange juice, two thirds of this orange marmalade jam, and go ahead and mix that all together until it's well combined. On top of that, you're going to add your cornstarch mixture and go ahead and mix everything together. Now your pot is still on saute, we want this to thicken up a little bit. Once it's thickened, go ahead and add all of your chicken back into your pot. Now with this recipe, I love to serve it on top of white rice. Up in the little corner, I'll show you how I make my rice in my Instant Pot. You can add sesame seeds or green onions on top. All right, you guys, thank you so much for joining me today. If you wanna check out more Instant Pot recipes, don't forget to come by every Monday or you can check out this Mongolian beef or my favorite ribs to make in the Instant Pot. I'll see you guys next week.